I did an event um, back in 09 uh, where I was just painting on shoes, you know, just for an event. Met um, Mayron for shoe, from Shoebiz. Um, ended up uh, getting really good ties with him. You know, that's one big thing that you got to do is if you're an artist, talk, 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 talk your way into doing whatever, you know, network. Whenever there's an event, I pretty much coordinate it and work the event. I mean, I hire a lot of artists that are brilliant, brilliant artists. And now, I mean, it's a, it's a every three months thing, you know, it's pretty cool. No disrespect to Tom's at all, but it just, I'm a Vans kid, you know, I love my Vans. Um, I, I never painted on any of my own shoes, but I'd probably paint a bunch of Japanese uh, art, you know, I'd actually, I like the, the whole tattoo stuff, uh, Japanese art, um, I think it's really inspiring work, I love the, the lines, the line work is actually pretty cool, so I'd probably paint some Japanese, definitely, definitely. I mean, it has been up and down, um, I've literally been broke within the past two years, at least like eight times no money in my pocket eight or nine times with every with every su success that you have I mean something there's always something that pulls you down and I think I really think it's just life telling you can you handle it can you really do it and if you can get through that you can get through anything you know um, being broke is one thing and you know if you're if you've been broke your whole life you can I mean you can achieve anything if you make it I mean you've already been there so what's the difference for everybody else you know like really so you know like it's pain, you know, and it's been struggle, but you know, it's all it's all good, you know. You live past it, and you work it out. Um, my biggest achievement is actually um, finding out that my dad actually likes my work, and coming from somebody like that's nep that's really just quiet about, you know, like just you need to go to school, you need to go to work and do your thing, you know. I understand that, but there was a point this year where he actually started following me on my blog and actually <laughs> telling his friends about my work and. You, and his friends are hitting me up, you know, on Facebook. It's like weird, you know, like finding out that people actually like your work and, you know, reaching that certain point that, you know, it makes you feel better about yourself that you're actually on the right direction and doing the right thing. And, you know, it, it works out, you know, it actually, um, it's all falling into place, really. My dad actually inspires me a lot. Um, my dad's an architect. He's a really, um, he is badass. I mean, I'm, I've been talking to him a lot lately about doing his own thing um, with art. And, um, you know, with my dad, it's just really um, inspiring. You know, he actually told me recently that I, he, I inspire him just because I'm doing what I want to do. You know, you're doing something for yourself, though. I mean, and I, I agree with anybody who follows their dreams. Do it. Everybody I feel, you know, should do their own thing in life. Uh, makes Whatever makes you happy, this is what makes me happy. So.